on you guys Riley on Jemmy inflatable fans 98 and I got a really cool review for you guys this is the Jemmy 2017 10 and a half foot praying mantis um, sold at Home Depot this year this was one of the main ones I wanted from the get-go um, mainly because I really like you know I love the spider inflatables and stuff like that and I just thought this is a really cool thing that they came out with um, wasn't a very popular design this year, I guess. I thought it would be. Um, so I ended up paying full price for this one, you know, because I was thinking in my mind that, oh, this thing's probably going to sell out pretty quick. Because it actually did. Because in the beginning, when it was first sold online, they actually sold out because it was actually online for 100 bucks um, on Home Depot's website. And they did sell out on the website at one point. And, uh, you know, then. You know, they came back there. The regular retail price is one twenty nine, dollars um, from what I remember. And I uh, paid full price for it, like I said. And, uh, you know, I could have gotten it online for, you know, 75% off, and I should have, um, but I didn't really want to wait. And uh, I wasn't even, I thought I was going to be able to use it this year in my display, but I didn't. I used it in my Halloween, in my Halloween night, but not in my uh, full display. Um, this year, you know, in the month of October. Um, but, um, I'm really happy I got it. I'm actually surprised that it doesn't have any animation. I figured there would have been an animation on this, maybe the head turning or the wings flapping or something. Um, but there was not any animation, unfortunately. Um, but it is still really cool. It's really big. It's got a really powerful fan. This thing inflates in like seconds, um, which is really cool. Um, like literally like five seconds that this thing's fully inflated. Um, and it's, you know, it's really not that big if you think about it. Like it's, it's not that tall. It's 10 and a half feet wide, but it's probably about eight feet tall from the top of the antenna, maybe a little shorter than that. I'm not good with <laughs> guessing height. Well, actually, yeah, it actually does say right here, 8.2 feet tall, um, and then 10 and a half feet wide. Um, I didn't even realize that it had that thing on there, but, uh, yeah, like I said, it's just got a green kaleidoscope. It honestly, it doesn't really, sh it shows up pretty good, but it doesn't really, it mostly only shows up in the front part where you can see on the picture, like the abdomen part here, it doesn't really show up on the back of it very well. Just that one little spot. And I don't believe there's any more internal lights in it from what I remember. But I guess we'll see in a second when I inflate it. So anyway, I'm going to pause the video here. I'm going to take it out of the box, then we'll inflate it. So I'll be right back. Alrighty, guys. So he's all taken out of the box here. So let's plug it in and inflate it. If I can even find the... There we go. Like I said, this thing inflates really, really fast. And I'm probably going to have to adjust it to fit it in this little spot here. Uh, let me pause the video one more time. I'm just gonna adjust it, and I'll be right back. Alrighty, guys. This is this thing's pretty big in this, you know, seeing it in this room. Um, so this thing is pretty big, and it's like I said, it's got the kaleidoscope light in it. It actually does have an internal light in its head. I didn't remember if it did or not. Um, but it's got the green and orange uh, kaleidoscope light in it. I actually have just a normal green and orange kaleidoscope light itself. Um, it's actually one of my favorite ones for Halloween, the green and orange one is one of my favorites. Um, but there's the fan down there, you can see, you know, it's it's not really covered up like most of the other ones are, if you know what I mean. Um, but nonetheless, I love this inflatable, it's huge, um, really big. Like I said, ten and a half feet long, eight, eight, almost eight and a half feet tall at the top of the antenna there. Um, Great inflatable, I really like it. And uh, if anyone can still get their hand, you know, their hands on it, 75% off on Home Depot's website, I recommend getting it. Great inflatable. I mean, if you have the yard for it, I get it. Like I said, this is a big inflatable. It might take up a lot of space if you don't have a big yard, but uh, yeah. So here's the kaleidoscope light in it. One thing, it probably doesn't show up good in the video. Let me get on the other side of it here. One thing. Uh, if you can see here, in a second, it actually seems like it's, it wasn't really sewed up that great here. You can see, it's hard to see, you might be able to see the little holes in it here, um, like right there. 
it's not just this one part. The other side's fine, but just this one part of it here isn't all that great. And uh, I hope it doesn't like, somehow detach itself at one at any point, because <laughs> that would uh, that would suck. But um, here it is, guys. Love this inflatable. Can't wait to use it in my full display next year. Next year is going to be bigger and better than ever. I know I keep saying that and it ends up not being that, but next year I promise you it'll be uh, great. So, uh, yeah, guys, anyway, Riley Quinlan on Jetting Inflatable Fans 98. Like and subscribe.